Welcome, dear visitor. I am Paul, the computer assistant for this session. In this tutorial, we will show how to use Microsoft Agent in VMware Workstation. This can help you solve the problem in case that Microsoft Agent doesn't work on Windows 7 or later. First, let's see how to install the Wear Workstation. Create a new virtual machine using the Wear Workstation. Uninstall Windows XP in Virtual Machine. Install VMware Workstation. You can also install a free version of VMware Player by downloading on the VMware website. When the installation is complete, click Create a new virtual machine. This is the wizard window. Click Next button to continue. Select I will install the operating system later. There are several versions of Windows XP like Professional, Home Edition, and 64-bit Edition. You can also select different version of Windows like 98 or 2000. From now on, we will select Windows XP Professional. You can give a name for the virtual machine and specify the location where the virtual machine will be created. Specify the size of virtual hard disk. Click Customize Hardware. 512 MB is the recommended memory for Windows XP, but you can adjust its size. If your computer has 2 GB of RAM, you may need to set it to 256 MB. Select CD slash DVD from the device list. If you don't have CD inserted on your computer, you can select Use ISO image file. Browse Windows XP ISO file. When done, click the close button. Click the finish button. Now you can install Windows XP in Virtual Machine. Click Power on the Virtual Machine. This is the Windows XP setup. You will need to use a keyboard to install Windows XP. To install Windows XP, press Enter. Press F8 key to accept the licensing agreement. To set up Windows XP on the selected partition, press Enter. There are two options to format the partition. Select Format the partition using the NTFS file system. Windows XP will now format the partition. Wait until the formatting process is finished. When the portion of setup is complete, Windows XP will automatically restart the virtual machine. You can press the Enter key to restart the virtual machine. When it restarts, setup will continue. Here is a nice looking Windows XP setup. Wait for a few minutes to bring up the installation dialog. Follow the installation instructions. You must enter a product key to continue the installation. This is the last part of the installation. This is the question mark assistant. He can help you set up your computer. This is the Windows XP desktop. There is still one more thing to do. 
You need to install VMware tools for Windows XP. To do this, click VM Install VMware Tools. This is the VMware tool setup. Click the next button to go on. Choose any setup type to install VMware tools. Then click the next button to continue. Click install button. Wait until the setup finishes installing VMware tools. Click the finish button. Click yes to restart the virtual machine. Congratulations, you have successfully installed Windows XP in Virtual Machine. Now you can use Microsoft Agent in Windows XP. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.